Is the Mammoth muffler really that good? Can it reduce noise and high pitch sounds? Let's find out in the video. Before starting the test, let's first check to room noise level. As you can see, the noise in the room is about 41 decibel. Let's power on the printer and check the new value with the printer running. As you can see, the noise with the printer running is about 47 up to 48 decibel. So let's start testing and see if the Mammoth CPAP muffler can really reduce the noise of the CPAP motor. First test, CPAP muffler is open and we will hear the sound and noise as if we are not using the Mammoth muffler. CPAP at 20%, 56 decibel, 2.5 airflow. CPAP at 40%, 71 decibel for 0.3 airflow. CPAP at 60%, 77.8 decibel, 6.7 airflow. CPAP at 80%, 85 decibel, 9 airflow. CPAP at 100%, 86.5 decibel, 9.7 airflow. I plotted the information in a line chart, so we can compare the two tests at the end of the video. Let's do the same test again, but this time with the Mammoth muffler. CPAP at 20%, 49 decibel, 2.5 airflow. CPAP at 40%, 56 decibel for 0.2 airflow. CPAP at 60%, 66 decibel, 6.5 airflow. CPAP at 80%, 73.6 decibel, 8.9 airflow. CPAP at 100%. 75 decibel, 9.6 air flow. At 100% CPAP, the Mammoth muffler is able to reduce the noise by 12 decibel and still delivering over 98% air flow, making the Mammoth muffler one of the best mods you can install on your 3D printer with CPAP part cooling. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell to get updates. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.